what's up everybody in today's video i'm gonna be explaining how me and my buddies got the trophy reunited with fidelina now this is one of the toughest trophies to actually earn in call of duty black ops cold war so let's get right into it this method is pretty much you and your team have to play smartly backing out and leaving at different time zones as you guys can see my buddy left and he actually joined the game now that he joined the game he has three lives and i currently have only one and now we're gonna finish off the zombies and we're gonna be in a safe zone which means i can go to the bathroom i can actually go eat i can actually go get a drink while he backs out real quick because he only has two lives i'd rather go on to the next round with three lives also the mama bat could sometimes spawn in during these moments but if she doesn't you guys are good to do whatever until the person actually comes back so once he actually comes back into the game he's gonna have three lives um, i believe two boosts and a nuke and once they actually spawn back in and they start moving around you guys are good to go um, if the mama back comes back or she attacks you guys just go to the next round it's gonna give them a couple of seconds to actually come back into the game you guys will be good now i'm gonna be talking about the wild the wild is kind of weird because if your player actually ends up leaving because he died too many times or he has zero lives and he leaves and he rejoins he's not going to be able to come back into the game just yet because he will have a black screen no matter what even if you enter a dungeon or another location in the map um you can see his character but they're still gonna have a black screen so be concerned about that also when they're in the black screen area your character is going to be chilling the whole time and you and your teammates can actually explore the whole while without losing any lives like you can pretty much walk around the whole while having zero lives go down and then and actually revive yourself with 50 something seconds and still be able to play in the wild so i must tell you guys that now as you guys can see we are currently on round one this is the first area to go you go to pretty much after you finish the island and the wild so i told my buddy i said hey just back out real quick i have zero lives i'll try to make it which i do end up making it he joins back into the game and this is when i fall down but i'm luckily saved because a he has three lives a nuke and a boost so now he's gonna finish off the zombies he honestly just left the game and came back into the game i told him you don't have to revive me just go to the next area which he does and once you go into the next area um if somebody is down for 55 seconds just go to the next area they're up right away and you guys can see he still has three lives and now if i really wanted to back out if i wasn't host i would have have three lives too this is me showing you guys what me and my teammates did as you guys can see i was the host i had nine lives and then the blue he pretty much had nine lives so we were good so we were letting red get everything so he can continue getting um as many points as he can and then we also let yellow pick up everything this is another cool little place you can actually um spawn uh area this little area right here is pretty good in this map to just camp out and kill zombies i'm also showing you another area for the next map pretty much on the bridge just chill here with your team and you guys will be good but i'm gonna be also showing you the boss fight which what we did the same steps where pretty much everybody was backing out at the same time i had pretty much nine lives as you guys can see i went down a lot of times but at the end of the day we completed it as you guys can see yellow just left but he's about to be back really soon as soon as he spawns in, I tell him, yo, hit a nuke, hit a nuke. Um, as soon as he does, we end up finishing the boss fight. So this is honestly the best method if you're trying to uh, complete this trophy. And like I said, it is one of the toughest trophies to actually receive in Call of Duty Black Ops Cold War. I honestly hope this video actually helps you guys out. Please let me know in the comments below if you still need any guidance or if you need a game session because I'm currently throwing game sessions out there for people who still need it. And I can probably play a game or two on Friday or Saturday this upcoming weekend. So if you're new to the channel, make sure to hit that subscribe button. Also show me some love with that thumbs up button. And uh, I'll see you guys in the next video and hope to see you guys in a game chat party. Peace.